الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على سيد رب المرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين. So the next thing that we need to talk about, and hopefully this is not going to be too controversial, but it needs to be said. And uh, I think a lot of people are already thinking along this line already, and we can see the benefits that this will bring. And this is giving dedicated spaces for girls and women within the mosque space and uh, it's encouraging that there are some projects that are um, working towards this now and we see that in the wider community in UK and we're, let's be clear here we're not talking about having the same prayer space so praying together in one space in one let's say uh, Jamaat Kana or one prayer hall what we're talking about is for women to have their dedicated space you know segregated space which allows them to gather and have spiritual gatherings together allows them to sit together in each other's company on a regular basis uh, learn together, pray together, etc. Okay, so again, we're not encouraging women to come to the five daily prayers. This is not what this is about. This is about women having a dedicated space where they can arrange gatherings, where they can arrange sit downs together, be in each other's company, you know, and they can also call over other women lecturers who can lecture them on different topics with related to the deen. So this will have massive, massive benefits. And normally what is happening now up and down the country is where the men's majalis gatherings are happening. Women uh, are given a section uh, in the masjid or outside the masjid, you know, with a, a connected uh, uh, screening or something where they can take part in the gathering um, but this is it this is limited to when men are having their gatherings at whenever uh, or whichever time they uh, arrange them so this is not something that the women can control themselves it's not something that they can have a, a say in or it's not something that they can uh, organize themselves so this is something uh, important for them so that it gives them the um, the control it gives them the the ability to arrange their own gatherings and having this space is so important in, in, in this time especially because we are already facing a lot of issues in terms of relationships in terms of uh, interactions uh, between uh, husband and wife and you know there's a, a mismatch there's a communication barrier you know uh, the man comes home you know charged up from his majlis and program and his learning and and the women are not taking part and and when he comes home and he's on a spiritual high and he's He's trying to get on board. She, she's, she just doesn't seem to get on board, and is not on the same wavelength. I mean, and then the the man's thinking, um, you know, what's going on? You know, why, why is she not responding? You know, but, but the problem is, you've just been to a gathering three hours, all charged up. Now you've been learning, you've been studying. Okay, now she's been at home, you know, looking after the kids or something else, and. And now you're you're coming and you're expecting her to be on the st same spiritual wavelength as you and uh, collaborate with you in in your thoughts and your thinking and your conversation where she's been uh, completely uh, disregarded in in this uh, in this aspect and f for maybe in some uh, areas in some mosques um, could be a very long time before they have a gathering of men where women do get invited and can just listen in or, or something so this is uh, of utmost importance again uh, for women to have girls to have their own dedicated space in this time of spiritual decline in this time of um, 
where women themselves are feeling isolated uh, and don't feel together, don't feel that they have the company where they can flourish and they can practice and they can share uh, ideas and you know their learning, share the the extra worship that they want to do. So this is of utmost importance and if we can uh, build on this and for Masajid, for people in authority and control uh, to can give a thought to this because there are many massages in the UK already you know built and these facilities are available so they don't need to be built these facilities are already available they just need to be given some thought and allocated and arranged in a way which can be uh, or made of uh, use in a better way